All right, what's up, crew? So we're gonna go get started today. We're gonna start with 45 seconds of running. Running in place or running in a circle or up and down circles, anything like that. And again, 45 seconds. I'm gonna work over the weekend a new style for curriculum. It's gonna be awesome. I'm looking forward to it. Me and Miss, uh, me and Kelly were talking about it uh, the other day. I'm gonna try to implement it. It's gonna be cool. It's gonna be fun. All that good stuff. About 15 seconds. All right, next thing we're gonna do, we're gonna do jump squats. We're gonna do jump squats. We're gonna jump out, squat, and come back. Begin. Now you have two ways of doing this. You can either stand and keep your feet apart and do a squat and jump in the air and clean. Or another way I like to do, I do a squat, I jump my feet together and then jump back out to a squat. Either way works. Either way works. Good, 10 seconds. 10 seconds. Hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. I've almost cut out all caffeine. All right, next thing, lunges. Lunges, lunges, lunges. If you wanna do backward lunges, you're welcome to do so as well. And again. Yeah, I'm almost cut out all caffeine. Almost the strict water and Gatorade. Can't wait till, actually, still better. 20 seconds, 20 seconds. <laughs> good song, good song. Although I know Trace, Trace still has a little bit of PTSD from the song. From the, uh, oh, what was it? The uh, demo that he was in with, we were all in with Mr. Haynes. All right, next thing, we're gonna hop from side to side. I don't know why, but I'm very dehydrated at this point. This thing was like up to here this morning. It's been three hours. I've almost drank the whole thing. Seven ounces? It wasn't full, full. It's a 32 ounce container. So I think that's probably around 47 ounces. All right. Now we're going to. Uh, da, da, da. We're going to lunge and punch with the back end. Lunge and cross. Begin. So we're lunging. So I'm gonna lunge with my left leg and I'm punching my right hand. So I'm alternating body. Fifteen seconds. All right. And last one, jumping jacks. Last one, jumping jacks. Hey, again.
Very good, very good. Keeping it going. 20 seconds. 20 seconds. Let's see it. How we doing? Have a seat, feet apart, down the middle.
And circles, and circles. Out of the way. All right, go ahead and shake it all out. Get your sip of water. If need be, for about three seconds. All right, from here. Combat sprint today are going to be squats and jab crosses. Sorry, I had to think about it for a second. So, I'm trying to change it up a little bit today. So, we're going to do squats, and then we're going to come up and two punches count as one. All right, so jab, cross, left, right, whatever, right, left, doesn't matter how you look at it. Two punches count as one. All right. Since we're not going to be having to go up and down, up and down, up and down, I'd recommend trying 10. All right, seven or 10. Okay. If you want to start at five, though, that's your choice. All right, you got two minutes, though. Squats and then two punches. Increments of five, seven, or 10, you're going to do, for, uh, for those of you, this is your first class. You're going to, sorry, Leanne, I got I to remember to do this other class. <laughs> um, so say I chose five. I'm going to do five squats. One, two, three, four, five. I'm going to do five, then I'm going to combo puzzle. One, two, three, four, five. And I'm going to go four. Three, four, one, two, three, four, all the way down to here. Yeah, you got two minutes. You're paid. All right, Leanne, are we ready? All right, here we go. And two minutes, go. Like I said, I recommend starting at seven or ten. Since we're not having to get up and down, but don't be your choice. 30 seconds down. Four of the way there. Keep it going. Doing great. Keep pushing, keep pushing. Remember to breathe. All right, breathing is your best friend. All right, make sure you're giving oxygen to your muscles and to your body, all right, to your lungs. Make sure you're not holding your breath, okay? Less than a minute. When you're doing that, a lot of times, that's the reason why so many people need to take more rest, take more breaks, because they're actually holding their breath and they don't realize it. It's a subconscious thing. So then once you consciously start making sure you breathe, then it recreates that habit. Okay, where then you start to breathe throughout the whole time. All right, make sure we're still always here. 30 seconds, 30 seconds. Almost done, keep pushing, don't stop, don't give up, don't quit. Ten seconds. Keep pushing. Three, two, one, and time. All right, very good job. Okay, from here we're gonna jump into solid foundation. We're gonna jump into our core class. We're gonna do a minute half rounds a day. We're gonna step it up a notch. 45 seconds just seems very short. Minute and a half probably gonna be too long. I ain't got no middle. All right. So we're gonna do a minute and a half and see how that goes. All right, first one, we're gonna start off with a jab cross. Okay, we're gonna start off with a jab cross. Moving around, all right, moving around, circling is what we call it. Okay, minute and a half of a jab and a cross. All right, we will do two rounds of this, so we will work both sides. So just stick on one side for now. If you switch your feet up during the toe, no big deal. All right, here we go. And then half, jab, cross, and go. You can also step in. 
So if they're going left or right, you can also step into it. You can step back. You know, any direction. I actually punched my lip. All right, minute left. All right, anyhow, halfway there, 45 seconds. You can do a couple of them in a the row. Like I just did. Step in, one, two. Step in, one, two. Step in, one, two. Then back off. Ten seconds. All right. From here, I want you to jump from side to side. I want you to imagine you're jumping over something. You got something to put there? Go ahead, please, to do it. If not, just imagine. All right, you're gonna do a little bit longer on breath. You need like 15 seconds, I think. So, a little bit more breath. I want you to jump from side to side. And begin. All right, one minute remains. <coughs> Halfway there, 45 seconds. Oh, clever one. Water goes down the wrong way. <coughs> Okay. Damn, all right. I ain't dying yet. You're good. Keep going. 20 seconds. All right. Five seconds. Three, two, one, and time. All right, other side. Gap props. And we might do the workouts at 45 seconds. Combinations, minute and a half, workouts at 45. You good with that, Leanne? You think that'd be a good thing to do? Yeah? All right, cool. All right, we'll try that out. And begin. Minute and a half, take box in. Remember, going in, coming out, going side, and going side. Now right, you can go all directions. Less than a minute. <clears throat> Thirty seconds. Keep it going. Fifteen seconds, almost there. This next one we're gonna do a little differently. All right, I 
think we might have done this on Tuesday, but I can't remember. Can't remember. But what we're going to do is we're in the next one, we're going to do 45 seconds. We're going to do push-ups. We're going to do them different style. <clears throat> I think we actually did do this on Tuesday, if I remember correctly. Uh, what we're going to do, though, is I want you to count to three when you're going down, holding it when you're coming back up. So, for example, one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. So if you notice, when I went down, I took it took three seconds to go down. I held it for three seconds, and then I'm coming back up for three seconds. All right, and I'll explain why after. All right. So you're gonna do nine, what I'm calling nine second push-ups. All right, three second interval push-ups. Okay, we're gonna do 45 seconds. Do the best you can on time. Ideally, you're gonna get about six in. So don't feel this. Don't feel disappointed or disappointed to yourself if you only get six in. That's kind of about average what you want. All right, that's the true if you're able to count exact seconds. All right, here we go though. I'm gonna shut up. I'm gonna let y'all go. 45 seconds begin. Going down three seconds, forward three seconds, come up three seconds. So I can teach you two car right now. Not really. All different instructions. And the timing is perfect. You should be on your last one now. Three, two, one, and time. All right, so the reason why we're doing that, what we're doing is our body works based off tension, okay, and off resistance, and our, that's how our muscles work, right? That's how, our, that's how we build muscle, okay? When you say you're doing just regular push-ups, right, going up and down, 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 your body's moving, yes, and your muscles are working, but you're working harder. You're having to do... 3,000 push-ups when, in retrospect, you could do, say, 300 and doing it the, the nine-second or the three-second interval push-ups and getting the same workout. Because what you're doing is, as you're going down, you're more or less resisting your body, holding your body, you're restricting your body. So your muscles are, your biceps are already tensed. And then when you're holding it, your body's tense. So your body's still under that tension. And then when you're coming up, you're slowly releasing the tension, but it's still there. So your body is about, it has nine seconds worth of that tension, that resistance, that tightening. So then it's actually burning more and it's working more. Okay. So you can play around with that. Do that with any kind of a uh, few various workouts. All right. Uh, some work, some don't. Some might have changed time up. Uh, for example, today's warm ups in the Taekwondo classes, uh, it was two second squats. So it was one, two, one, two, one, two. And that was because three seconds felt like it was really long uh, for those. So it does vary. Uh, so you can play around with that, have fun with that. Uh, that's the only one I've really kind of stuck to, though, is the push-ups and then the squats as well. Um, anywho, now let's go to the other side. What we're going to do, jab, cross, hook, low kick. And when I mean low kick, I'm talking you're going for the knees. You're going for the ankles. You're trying to take the leg out. All right, you're trying to, if there's someone much taller than you, you're trying to bring them down to your height. All right, so jab, cross, hook, low kick. Okay, and you may, if they're too close to you, um, you may have to do it with the front leg. Okay, it can vary. All right, every situation is different. By the time you get through those three punches, they might have stepped back a little bit, so you might be able to do that back leg. Yeah, that just depends. Okay, so when you're throwing that hook though, so jab, cross, notice my hand comes right back to my face. The hook comes from my face straight in. Straight in. Okay, I like my thumb up. Uh, you're going for the temple. Gives you a lot more room for error than here. You only got about, say, two inches. Here you got about four or five inches, right? So room for error. Room for error is amazing. But a lot of times I see a lot of this, but people like to swing out. 
Okay, what you're doing is you're adding extra time that you don't want. You want that reaction to be quick. You want speed to be fast. So jab, cross, hook, straight in, and then that low kick. Either front leg or back leg, does not matter to me. All right, here we go though. I'm gonna set up. Minute and a half, and go. Turn the music up. You're welcome to practice with both, using the front leg and the back leg. You might have to follow them. You might have to step back. Very good, minute left. Trying to save as much of this water as I can to try to stay hydrated as much as I can too. That's in 30 seconds. Keep it up, keep it up. Five seconds. All right, next exercise. We're going to do a raise arm catches. So you're here. When you do the raise arm what? You're going to reach for the spot. Okay, you're going to reach above you. Okay, not in front of you. All right. So you come up, reach high, come back down. Just like that. All right, 15 seconds. And time. All right, go to the other side now. Jab, cross, hook, low kick. Right. Jab, cross, hook, low kick. Begin. Very good. Keep it going. Keep it going. That's when I keep moving. Keep moving. 45 seconds. Halfway through. Fifteen seconds. Three, two, one, time. All right, this is the water. We're about to go to the fitness challenge, formerly known hyper challenge. We're going to call it the fitness challenge, cardio challenge. I don't know. Figure it out.
I'll come up with something. All right. So today we're gonna to start off with flutter kicks. Flutter kicks. Scissor kicks. Uh, many different ways of calling them. So you're gonna be down on the ground just like so. Just like this. For the first minute. For the first minute. All right, here we go. Here we go. Quite a kick starting now. That's the job. That's the job. We're almost done. Keep moving. Almost done. Last little bit. About 30 seconds left on Flutter Kicks. Keep it moving, keep it moving. 15 seconds. Great job, great job. Moving fast, moving fast. Excellent, excellent. Five, four, three. Two. Next one, Russian twist. Russian twist. Bounce on your elbow from side to side. For the next minute. If you need to, you can keep your feet on the ground. Uh, but the goal is to have your feet off the ground. You want to just bounce on your elbow. But again, if for whatever reason you need to, go for it. Well, I'd rather be doing something than doing nothing. All right. So. I have about 30 seconds left of this. Keeping it moving. Breathing. Remember, breathing, 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 breathing. All right. We're almost done. We're already one down. Working on our second one, being down. Great job. Great job. 15 seconds. 15 seconds. Five seconds. All right, next round, come up. Jumping jacks. Jumping jacks, jumping jacks, jumping jacks. Always constantly moving. Always constantly moving. Constant movement. Doing great, though. Doing great. We are almost halfway through this cardio challenge. I think I like cardio challenge better than fitness challenge. I don't know. Play with them all. Halfway through. Halfway through. Two and a half minutes. 30 seconds over jumping jacks. Great job, great job, great job. 15 seconds. Awesome. Awesome. Keeping it going. Great, great, great. Five, four, three, two. Next one, toe touches. Toe touches just like so. You do not have to reach up if you don't want to. Just touch it. Reach down, touch your toes, and come right back up. Very good, very good. We're standing up. Hands can be at your waist. Go down, touch your toes, and then come back up. And reset. Very good, very good. <laughs> Less than 30 seconds on this one. We got one more left. One more left. Doing great, doing great. 15 seconds, 15 seconds. Five, four, three, two. Next one's lunges. Let's finish off with some lunges. Let's finish it off with lunges. Great job, great job. Doing great. Okay, doing great. Keeping it moving. That's the thing. Going at your pace. That's you too. 
Don't worry about going at somebody else's pace. Go at your pace. Everyone's at a different level. 30 seconds. Excellent job, excellent job. 15 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and time. All right, let's see how much time we got left. All right, go ahead and take the next two minutes. Cool down, stretch on your own. Okay, cool down, stretch on your own. I'm going to put some cool down music on, or try to at least. Uh, see if I can just search that. Cool down, playlist. Oh, let's see what happens. Uh, da, da, da. Today's easy hits. Mm. Try it out, see what happens. Worst case scenario, I don't like it. We don't do it ever again. We'll see what happens. Not a part of my playlist. None of it said explicit, but I can't promise. Okay, so, <laughs> uh, but just put down stretch on your own. Whatever feels tense, whatever feels tight, okay? Stretching out during this time. You got about a minute left, okay? The more you stretch now, the less sore it will be later, okay? Also a big thing, hydrate a lot, breathe. Energize those muscles, okay? Give those nutrients and everything that you just worked out, okay? Give them some back so that way they can repair themselves. All right. um, icy hot or pain reliever, stuff like that. Um, my favorite icy hot is the one that has the roller part instead of the clean, where you know you don't have to do that, you just roll it. Uh, great for self use as well. Um, and it also has lidocaine in it, which helps with pain relief as well. 30 seconds. It works great and it almost instantly. So, nice warm bubble bath to work. All that good stuff. Anything that helps you relax. Deep breaths, things of that nature. Whatever helps you relax, relax your body, relax your muscles. You got about 10 seconds left. All that good stuff. All right. Three, two, one, and five. All right. Great job today. And I will see y'all next time. Dismissed. Later, later.